The German Shepherd, German, Deutsche or Schäferhund, German pronunciation, DTFHNT, is a breed of medium to large sized working dog that originated in Germany. According to the FCI, the breed's English language name is German Shepherd Dog. The breed was officially who, known as the Alsatian Wolf Dog in the UK from after the First World War until 1977 when its name was changed back to German Shepherd. Despite its wolf-like appearance, the German Shepherd is a relatively modern breed of dog, with their origin dating to 1899. As a herding dog, German Shepherds are working dogs developed originally for herding sheep. Since that time, however, because of their strength, intelligence, trainability, and obedience, German Shepherds around the world are often the preferred breed for many types of work, including disability assistance, search and rescue, police and military roles and acting. The German Shepherd is the second most registered breed by the American Kennel Club and seventh most registered breed by the Kennel Club in the Kingdom. German Shepherds are medium to large-sized dogs. The breed standard height at the withers is 60, 65 cm, 24, 26 in, for males, and 55, 60 cm, 22, 24 in, for females. German Shepherds are longer than they are tall, with an ideal proportion of 10 to 812. The AKC official breed standard does not set a standard weight range. They have a domed forehead, a long square cut muzzle with strong jaws and a black nose. The eyes are medium-sized and brown. The ears are large and stand erect, open at the front and parallel, but they often are pulled back during movement. A German Shepherd has a long neck, which is raised when excited and lowered when moving at a fast pace as well as stalking. The tail is bushy and reaches to the hock. German Shepherds have a double coat which is close and dense with a thick undercoat. The coat is accepted in two variants, medium and long. The gene for long hair is recessive, and therefore the long-haired variety is rarer. Treatment of the long-haired variation differs across standards, it is accepted but does not compete against standard-coated dogs under the German and UK Kennel Clubs while it can compete with standard-coated dogs, but is considered a fault, in the American Kennel Club. The FCI accepted the long-haired type in 2010, listing it as the variety B, while the short-haired type is listed as the variety A. Most commonly, German Shepherds are either tan slash black or red slash black. Most color varieties have black masks and black body markings which can range from a classic saddle to an overall blanket. Rarer color variations include the sable, pure black, pure white, liver, silver, blue, and panda varieties. The all black and sable varieties are acceptable according to most standards, However, the blue and liver are considered to be serious faults and the all-white is grounds for instant disqualification from showing in conformation at all breed and specialty shows. German Shepherds were bred specifically for their intelligence. In a list of breeds most likely to bark as watchdogs, Stanley Corin ranked the breed in second place. Coupled with their strength, this trait makes the breed desirable as police, guard, and search and rescue dogs, as they are able to quickly learn various tasks and interpret instructions better than other breeds. German Shepherds are moderately active dogs and are described in breed standards as self-assured. The breed is marked by a willingness to learn and an eagerness to have a purpose. They are curious, which makes them excellent guard dogs and suitable for search missions. They can become overprotective of their family and territory, especially if not socialized correctly. They are not inclined to become immediate friends with strangers. German Shepherds are highly intelligent and obedient, as well as protective of their owners. While an Australian report from 1999 provides statistics showing that German Shepherds are the breed third most likely to attack a person in some Australian locales, once their popularity is taken into account, the percentages of GSD attacks drops to 38. According to the National Geographic Channel television show Dangerous Encounters, the bite of a German Shepherd has a force of over 1,060 newtons, 238 lbf, compared with that of a Rottweiler, over 1,180, 1,460 newtons, 265, 328 lbf, a pit bull, 1,050 newtons, 235 lbf, a Labrador retriever, of approximately 1,000 newtons, 230 lbf, or a human, of approximately 380 newtons, 86 lbf. 
The modern German Shepherd breed is criticized by some for straying away from Max von Stefanitz's original ideology that German Shepherds should be bred primarily as working dogs and that breeding should be strictly controlled to eliminate defects quickly. He believed that, above all else, German Shepherds should be bred for intelligence and working ability. The Kennel Club, in the United Kingdom, is involved in a dispute with German Shepherd breed clubs about the issue of soundness in the show strain of the breed. Some show strains have been bred with an extremely roached top line, back, that causes poor gait in the hind legs. The debate was catalyzed when the issue was raised in the BBC documentary, Pedigree Dogs Exposed, which said that critics of the breed describe it as half dog, half frog. An orthopedic vet remarked on footage of dogs in a show ring that they were not normal. The Kennel Club's position is that this issue of soundness is not a simple difference of opinion, it is the fundamental issue of the breed's essential conformation and movement. The Kennel Club has decided to retrain judges to penalize dogs suffering these problems. The Kennel Club also recommends testing for hemophilia and hip dysplasia, other common problems with the breed. German Shepherds are a popular selection for use as working dogs. They are known for being easy to train and good for performing tasks and following instructions. They are especially well known for their police work, being used for tracking criminals, patrolling troubled areas and detection and holding of suspects. Additionally, thousands of German Shepherds have been used by the military. Usually trained for scout duty, they are used to warn soldiers to the presence of enemies or of booby traps or other hazards. German Shepherds have also been trained by military groups to parachute from aircraft or as anti-tank weapons. They were used in World War II as messenger dogs, rescue dogs, and personal guard dogs. A number of these dogs were taken home by foreign servicemen, who were impressed by their intelligence. The German Shepherd is one of the most widely used breeds in a wide variety of scent work roles. These include search and rescue, cadaver searching, narcotics detection, explosives detection, accelerant detection and mine detection dog, among others. They are suited for these lines of work because of their keen sense of smell and their ability to work regardless of distractions. At one time the German Shepherd was the breed chosen almost exclusively to be used as a guide dog for the visually impaired. When formal guide dog training began in Switzerland in the 1920s under the leadership of Dorothy Eustace, all of the dogs trained were German Shepherd females. An experiment in temperament testing of a group of Labrador Retrievers and German Shepherds showed that the Retrievers scored higher on average in emotional stability, ability to recover promptly from frightening situations, cooperative behavior, and friendliness, while the German Shepherds were superior in aggression and defensive behavior. These results suggested that Labrador Retrievers were more suited to guide dog work while German Shepherds were more suited to police work. Currently, Labradors and Golden Retrievers are more widely used for this work, although there are still German Shepherds being trained. In 2013, about 15% of the dogs trained by Guide Dogs of America are German Shepherds, while the remainder are Labrador Retrievers and Golden Retrievers. The Guide Dogs for the Blind Association in the United Kingdom trains some German Shepherds, while the comparable organization in the US only trains Labrador Retrievers, Golden Retrievers, and crosses between these breeds. German Shepherds are still used for herding and tending sheep grazing in meadows next to gardens and crop fields. They are expected to patrol the boundaries to keep sheep from trespassing and damaging the crops. In Germany and other places these skills are tested in utility dog trials also known as Herdengebrauchshund, HGH, Herding Utility Dog Trials. One Mexican-German Shepherd, Zewiakwai, was dissected and his body put on display at the Sedanas Narco Museum in Mexico. He is regarded to be the dog who has captured the most drugs in Mexican police and military history. During the 1850s, attempts were being made to standardize dog breeds. Dogs were being bred to preserve traits that assisted in their job of herding sheep and protecting their flocks from predators. In Germany this was practiced within local communities, where shepherds selected and bred dogs. It was recognized that the breed had the necessary skills for herding sheep, such as intelligence, speed, strength, and keen senses of smell. The results were dogs that were able to do such things, but that differed significantly, both in appearance and ability, from one locality to another. Tell us your favorite breed of dog and why.